Hello everybody, Huge Dev here, and welcome back to the Elder Scrolls Skyrim Special Edition. Uh, in this episode, I've already talked to Azura, so now I've got to go and... Oh look, you're en route. And now I've got to go to a fort, which is just right up the way, right there. Uh, just got to go to this fort, check it out, say, uh, find a dead guy and do things to his corpse like take his or his star off of it you know just stuff like that uh. good lord you gotta wonder how long this guy has been dead for that this entire place sank, this thing is now a skeleton, and this place is just in ruins. And yet, I'm pretty sure there are still people here. Pretty sure. Like, oh yeah, there's skeletons and there's... Whoops. There's necromancers. Harvest blood, yeah, high elf. How am I gonna get an orc's blood? I just have to find a bandit that's an orc, I guess. Hi. Don't bring your, I need their blood. Oh, I need to see if I can use their pie. get there. Okay, can I use your blood? Do I need yours yet? Yeah, hi. Oh, Dark Elf. I thought you were a high elf there for a second. Oh, well. This is a great place to get blood. I didn't want the Nord Mead. Screw Nord Mead. Okay, let's see here. So... Why would they have plenty of potions of healing and stamina, but none for magic? I mean, they're mages, aren't they? Well, they're necromancers. And they just brought that. Uh, magic regenerates 75. Mine does far more. Shouldn't that skeleton have died? Slarfish scales. Oh. <laughs> okay. So, this place is eerie and disturbing. Hello, human. As a dark hill. Are, are resistant to uh, fire. That's why that was doing less. Ooh, extra magic. Fury. Do I have fury? I feel like I have fury. I do have fury. Screw that book. Should probably upgrade my lock picking. I keep saying that and then I keep forgetting. Oh, yes, that's where they're hiding them all. They're hiding them all in the bedrooms. I don't care about your destruction crap. So, do you have an arcane enchanter? You do. Let me see if I can disenchant that. That would be nice. Because then I could actually have some robes that... 
Oh, yeah. Well, who the heck is nearby that they... Who's interfering with my... Uh, with another one. Don't heal yourself, dang it. Anyway. There we go. Okay, so now that they're dealt with, did you notice that the, um, I don't know if you could have that if you heard it or not, but did you notice that when the oh, just the ring? I already have destruction things. That's prime. Man. When I killed the uh, uh, bandit and released his soul or whatever, I guess uh, he actually said thank you. So that guy was actually still here in a sense of his mind was still bound to his body as well. It wasn't just um wasn't just a you know soulless husk of a body. He still had his mind intact. He was just under his under that necromancer's control. Cool. That's really unfortunate. And really disturbing. Okay. Considering what it is I'm doing and with how far I have to travel, it's actually surprisingly this is a very short uh, at Ohio. It's a very short um, quest. Oh, I already got Heil. But I already have that. Doors of Oblivion. I guess I've already read it. Gem. I don't want the Soul Gem Fragments. Screw Soul Gem Fragments. They are completely useless. I don't want them. Where is that? Screw that thing. I'll take the full one. I don't want the partial. The partials suck. They have no purpose. They're useless. Don't want them. Yeah, the only thing that could have really done any of real harm to me was that skeleton. Die, 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 die so they'll die. Crap, they're alive. Ah, go away. Don't want you. Was that all the skeletons you resurrected? Mine has an area of effect damage. Hey, hey. Are you? Yeah, you seem like Master of the Arcane. Black Soul Gym. So you can actually choose whether you want uh, Azura Star in this to be a black uh, soul gem over a regular soul gem. I much prefer the regular soul gem because then you don't have to kill people or kill a bunch of people in order to... Uh... Ooh. I'm keeping this. Uh, you don't have to kill a bunch of people in order to just refill it because every time... 
uh, every time you would want it filled, you'd have to kill a person. Which, granted, you could just go to go find a bandit and kill them, but I much prefer using animals because it's much uh, much easier to run across a pack of wolves, kill one of them, and get their soul than it is to than it is to. Uh, Uh, find some bandits because from what I've noticed you typically run into a lot more animals than you run into uh, people I don't know if Falmer count as people or animals though I'm not really sure I think they count as people I don't know because uh, what are they called uh, Azura Star I knew the Lady of Twilight had sent you for a reason Hand it over to me. I will ask Azura to restore the star to its original purity. Hag ravens count as beasts. Here, take it. I will commune with Azura. Azura, mother of roses, goddess. See, right now it's uh, Azura's black your star. champion has returned your star to me. It's she made entirely out of. Yourself. Please place your hands on the altar. Okay. It's made entirely out of soul gem. You have followed my guidance through the veils of twilight and rescued my star from Malan Varan. But his soul still resides within, protected by his enchantments. Until he is purged, my artifact is useless to you. Okay. Eventually, the star will fade back into my realm in oblivion, but I doubt you have the hundred or so years it would take to wait. Oh, I could find a way. No, only one option remains. I will send you inside the star. You will banish Malin's soul there. Tell me when you are ready, mortal. Sure, yeah. Have faith, mortal. Have going I will be store. watching over you. Ah, yeah. my disciples have sent me a fresh soul. Good. I was getting hungry. Why? There's something different about you. This experiment of yours is over. And who are you to challenge me? I have conquered mortality itself. I've spat in the eyes of the Daedric Lords. This is my realm now. I've sacrificed too much to let you take it from me. Um. Your heart. Those are useful. Yeah, I have fireballs as well. How do you like them apples? Delicious, aren't they? The star is free to purify itself. Don't worry, mortal. I will return you before you are cleansed. My star has been restored, and Malin's soul has been consigned to oblivion. You have done well, mortal. 
As was destined, you are free to use my star as you see fit. I just like the days you're looking into my future. Oblivion has been watching you since the day you were conceived, That's mortal. Do not think that your really life disturbing. has been served by your will alone. That's really disturbing. Go now! I have seen the threads of your fate in the twilight, and you still have much to accomplish. That's your star. There's your... Aww. Oh, cool, now I have zero star. Okay, so I could talk to her and get her as a companion, but I don't really like companions that get in my way. I think I'm going to leave this episode here. Figure, uh... I'll just cut this one a little short. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I... Uh, I hope to see you in the next episode. Bye, guys.